Hey guys, so today I want to do a quickly a video on um, what I think is like the best uh, 150 euro phone you can get right now. And it's with this uh, company called Xiaomi, which has been very, very impressive lately. Uh, and, uh, you know, I've been buying a lot of phones from them and they've been just been keeping up a very, very good quality. So this phone right now is well before 150 euro and I will leave a link in the description. And... Uh, there are different variants of it basically uh, first uh, you do have a two gigabyte variant and then there is uh, that one is 120 euro uh, but this one uh, which i have over here is the Xiaomi redmi 4. some people have been saying that it is the uh, the redmi 4 prime but it's not uh, if I go into Geekbench here, I can see that it says Xiaomi Redmi 4, uh, but the Redmi 4 Prime also has uh, Snapdragon 625 and also 3 gigabytes of RAM. Uh, the standard version of Redmi 4 has uh, 2 gigabytes of uh, RAM. This one also has an octa-core uh, octa CPU. So that is very, very nice. So eight different cores. I did a benchmark test here also, uh, which basically gives it a multi-core score of almost 3000. So you can also see here eight cores when I go down. And uh, basically it, it's many reasons why I think this device is one of the best for 150 euro right now. Uh, first of all, it's the overall kind of quality of this device, of how it's built. Uh, it doesn't feel cheap. It has this nice kind of heavy weight to it, kind of like an iPhone 4 or 4S, uh, but also with this very, very nice matte feeling, uh, but also with some modern functionality like a, uh, a fingerprint sensor. So if I just go into uh go into i think lock screen and password screen lock and fingerprint i can just add my fingerprint instantly uh pattern draw pattern again okay and then i just hold my fingerprint on the other side You're ready to rock. Okay, great. Okay, so it's finished. Let's try it out. Okay, instantly. You can see here that it's locked. Normal mode. But instantly, very, very fast fingerprint unlock. Uh, the other thing here is the camera. The camera, when I take photos with it, let's see. is very, very fast. And I also want to show you kind of like the details so you can take some very very nice details if I just open this one up here it has a very very fast uh, sort of focus and when I go and take and, and look at photos I can see that it's extremely like uh, clear uh, everything looks nice you have a quick uh, little edit buttons to quickly go in and customize photos just very very nice with the latest MI UI and also in terms of performance let's just fire up game loft here pretty fast so you can get a little bit of an idea of uh, the performance uh, with the snapdragon 625 you can also see it has uh, three different buttons here on the side Okay, let's try this out. So you can kind of see, I'm gonna uh, see how the performance is also on the outside. But in here I can feel like buttery, butter smooth performance. Okay, great. We'll see how it performs on the outside. He's gonna wait. Strike through to Monarch. Target eliminated. Confirm extraction location. Over. Uh, hold up. Okay, great. Come on. Let's go. He's gonna grab nice. his friend up. No, come on. 
Is this one of those games where you need an internet connection and if it loses it instantly, it's not working? Oh my god, you cannot be tr that cannot be true. I'm just gonna see. I really dislike when games do that. I mean, that's really, really bad. So what I'm gonna do... That's pretty stupid. I really don't like games that is doing things like that. So I'm just gonna go into... Quickly go into settings... But I am connected. I mean, look at this. Yes. Okay. It works perfectly. Oh my god. That's a really stupid thing. Oh no, it works again. Okay, so let's see how the performance is down here. Oh my god, I missed. I'm really dumb. But uh, still no issues or anything, no slowdown. So you can see they're very, very nice uh, performance. Now, if I um, if I just go and uh, also check out the browser a little bit quick. Uh, oh, nice Galaxy S8 UI. I can also see that the phone performs really, really well. Okay, great. Kind of. Nice there with some S8 stuff. Okay, great, performs well. And uh, let's see here. I can check out my photos. The gallery looks good. And also modern UI in here in all of the major apps. And I also like how a lot of phones doesn't have this option to quickly uh, be able to change the default transitions, but you do get that with Xiaomi, so that is also very, very nice. Uh, let's see, Cascade, and also that you have a lot of cool default uh, kind of wallpapers already ready to go, which is also is um, a nice little extra thing over there. If I check out here, I can also see very, very nice menus, multitasking kind of looks like this and also no kind of slow down so that is also good I also think it had a big battery I think it was like 4000 milliamps I'm not sure if I can see it in here uh, 1080p display 442 ppi uh, the graphic processing at Renault 506 Android 6.0.1 also it's very important to know that it's running a new version of Android and also very, very nice here with some uh, quick toggles, things you can go in and uh, quickly tweak. So yeah, I mean, I gotta say, I mean, for 150 euro, uh, it's a pretty, pretty good deal right now. And I also want to say that I do buy all my phones uh, myself. Yeah, i always been doing it. I mean, been buying over 200 phones. So I can really say what I want uh, in my videos, which is really, really nice. And um, yeah, I really just wanted to do this video here because I mean, for overall, for for this price, it's a very, very nice phone. So I will leave a link in the description if you want to check it out. Uh, but yeah, quick video. Uh, let me know if you want to see something else on some other phones. I might be able to do that as well. Uh, but yeah, have an awesome day.